Hey guys, it's Rob. Another how to fix it video on cars. Um, so what happened here? I, I have a 2006 Buick Rendezvous and I was out driving and noticed that my brakes seemed to be seizing. I was accelerating, the car wasn't moving very well and uh, eventually I started getting a shudder and smell of burning brake pads. So I pulled over uh, waited about half an hour, the brakes actually released, and luckily I was able to carefully drive home. Um, so what I did was I bought brand new, uh, re well not brand new, but rebuilt calipers. Uh, got home, um, lubed up the pads, uh, sanded them a bit because they were a little bit damaged from the, uh, from the locking up. And when I went um, and uh, put everything back together, tried to bleed the lines, I had no brake pressure whatsoever on the pedal. Uh, so by bleeding quite a bit, I was able to eventually get um, uh, some pedal pressure with the vehicle off. But as soon as I turned the vehicle on and the brake booster was working, the pedal went straight to the floor. So again, tried to bleed it a few more times, I had no idea what was going on, thought maybe something else got damaged, although the brakes, um, the brake pedal was absolutely fine before this incident. So anyway, uh, it turns out I made uh, a mistake that apparently is not uh, totally uncommon, but I thought I'd share it with you in case you run into this. So when I installed the brake caliper, uh, kind of like this, you'll notice that what's supposed to happen is the bleed screw is supposed to be on this side. So if you put the wrong caliper on the wrong side, so there's actually a left and right caliper, so this is, is the left caliper, if you put the right caliper on the side, what you'll notice is the bleed screw is on the bottom, not on the top. And if you do that, what's going to happen is the air can't get out. The air rises, it's lighter than the fluid, so the fluid's in here, the air's got to escape at a higher point. And once you've got it wrong, in other words, you've got the bleed screw at the bottom, you cannot get the air out of the system. So that's a mistake I made. So now what I did was I... Uh, uh, took the uh, calipers off again. Um, I got some new gaskets for them. They have little copper uh, O-ring gaskets. And uh, so now what I'm doing is I'm reinstalling it. I'm going to bleed it again. And that way I can have proper pedal pressure. So if you run into this, um, I didn't know, but now I do. Uh, calipers are left and right. Um, I guess it does pay to make sure when you put a part on, it looks exactly like the part you took off. So had I checked that, I would have realized that I had the wrong side. Hope this is helpful, guys. Thanks for tuning in.